All right, uh, hey, what's up everybody? I'm Gutex, doing coverage at Ladies of Street Fighter 4 here at Arcade Infinity, ForgetYourTournament.com. I'm here with Shu, the man behind all of this Ladies of Street Fighter 4 madness, Shu and Nom Nom Naomi. <laughs> hey, what's up? Uh, how did it go, first of all? Okay, let's start with you, Shu. How did Ladies of Street Fighter 4 come about, and uh, how do you think it went? Well, it probably came out like this. I was at work. Huh, a girl tournament, why not? So, uh, I had a plan for like, I had to give a lot of heads up, just because I knew I wasn't going to find that many girls right away. So what I had to do, at, everybody I know, hey, do you know a girl? Do you know a girl? Do you know a girl? Bring her. Bring her. But she doesn't want to. Bring her anyway. Just get them to play. Make them practice. What do you think the trick is to getting the girls actually interested in playing? Um, a lot of the girls that have been here to any tournament, like Naomi or Teresa, they know how AI gets, how it gets fun, it gets hype, everybody has fun. And if they could somehow be, like, be tied with that, like causing all that hype, then maybe they'll, they'll enjoy more, you know? Because they have to be here anyways and watch their boyfriends play? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> okay. Um, how do you tell me about the turnout? I mean, was this was this more or less about as many players as you expected? About as much as I expected. Uh, I. What about the spectators? Tell me, did you think that this many people would show up to watch? Yeah, yeah, I knew it was gonna fill up quick. I knew it was gonna be packed. Because you put girls and Street Fighter together, and the nerds come out of the woodwork. And guys just want to watch, you know. I, you know, we. I really didn't know what to expect, but there were a lot of people here. There was pro probably just as many people as a regular. Uh, you know, with guys, the, you know, with the Street Fighter tournament. People will flicker in and out. Yeah, but this people stay for the whole thing. The whole thing. It lasted about what? Four hours, maybe? Five hours? It was a really quick tournament. Right. Awesome. Awesome. So, uh, what's in store? Are we going to do this again, latest Street Fighter Four? Um, probably not this summer. We got a whole bunch of things coming up. We have a, a Ranbat season to finish. We have Evo coming up. We have people that are still practicing for EVO. We have a West Coast War Zone coming up. Labor Day weekend. Labor Day weekend. Good stuff, good stuff. Well, I'm sure it'll be on... Uh... We got a lot of good Street Fighter shit coming up. Right. But now this is one of them. This is one of them. <laughs> awesome. The Congratulations on a very successful event. Thank you. Now, the real star. Get out of here, man. Get your, get your balls out of here. <laughs> Now, Naomi, um, you being uh, close with Shu, um, what did you think of this whole Ladies of Street Fighter 4 tournament when he first was like, hey, Naomi, I'm going to throw a Street Fighter 4 tournament for girls such as yourself? Um, honestly, at first, I begged him not to do this because I haven't even practiced yet. Like, I've yeah, gone why to. Do you have to play? Well, I like Street Fighter, so why okay. not? <laughs> so, you're, so you're so down to play, you were like, why did you tell me? Six months ago, so I could have started practicing. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Awesome. But awesome. now that I'm in it, I makes me want to practice more and go into more tournaments now. Awesome. So, uh, who do you use, and why do you use that character? Um, I've used Chung Lee basically because I've used her since I was little. So it's just like a force of habit. So you play past, past Street Fighter games? Yes, I have. Tell tell me about your Street Fighter history. Um, to be honest, it's just like. I've never really learned the techniques or anything. It's just like pressing buttons. But now that I know and I'm learning, it's a lot more fun to play. So I mean, you you would play? Do you have siblings? You yeah, yeah. okay? Okay. So you yeah. play when you were a kid. Yeah, yeah. And now you have a boyfriend who's putting together ladies of Street Fighter tournaments. So now of course you play. Okay. So what uh what turn uh, what place did you get? I believe I got seventh, but since it wasn't even doubt, I think it's tied seventh. Okay, tied for seventh. Not bad, not bad. Very nice for for a first tournament. Um, are you going to be playing in the next one? Um, if not the ladies of Street Fighter, maybe another regular Rambat, maybe? A regular Rambat. Awesome. Awesome. That's great. That's great. What would you say to girls who are maybe on the fence about playing Street Fighter, especially in a tournament? Um, I would say just get into it. I mean, even if you lose, you know, it's, it's just fun to be in it. Do you think that girls take losses differently than guys? No, I think they're not as bad as guys. Because they know, I mean, I don't know. I didn't take it as bad. But what if you, what if, I mean, what if you'd, what if you had been playing for six months? What if you had been practicing hard for six months and then some chick walks up and rolls you after she's been playing for like two weeks? Are you going to take that to heart? Probably, but I mean, you always have to practice. Even if you're placing top all the time, you still need to practice. You can always do better. Always do better. Awesome. Well, Naomi, congrats. We'll see you at the next Ladies of Street Fighter 4 tournament.